This tutorial covers the process of replacing the fan in a Pi Boy DMG. New fans can be bought from the Experimental Pi website. Begin by flipping the Pi Boy over, opening the battery compartment, and removing the battery. Using the included screwdriver, unscrew the six screws holding the case back on. Lift the case back off to expose the internals of the Pi Boy. Next, we'll need to detach the ribbon cables attached to the fan board. Start by gently lifting the screen cable. Then, open the gray latch holding the white ribbon cable in place. Now, remove the four screws holding the fan board in place. Gently lift the fan board off of the Raspberry Pi's header pins. You'll want to remove the power switch before doing this. As you lift the board, guide the ribbon cable out of its header. Lay the board to the side. Separate the fan board from the Pi Boy by disconnecting the power cable. Set the Pi Boy aside so that you can work on the fan board. Next, we'll need to remove the old fan from the fan board. Start by removing the male pins holding the fan in place. Next, push the female pins out to remove the fan. To finish removing the old fan, disconnect the power cable from the fan board. Now, using a new fan and pins, we'll install the new fan into the fan board. Holding the fan sticker side up, insert two female pins into the fan. Now, place the new fan in the fan board. Now, using two male pins, secure the fan in the board. The fan wire should be on the same side of the board as the female header and should face away from the female header. Finish the assembly by connecting the power cable. The black lead faces the text on the board. Note, the connector only goes in one way. The first step in reinstalling the fan board is inserting the white ribbon cable into its header. Grab the fan board with the header facing down. Carefully insert the ribbon cable into the plastic header. Once the cable is fully seated, close the gray latch.
Next, reconnect the fan board power cable. The red lead faces the screw closest to the header. Next, carefully push the fan board down onto the Pi's male header pins. Secure the fan board to the Pi Boy by screwing in its four screws. Next, gently press the screen cable back in place. It will snap in place once secured. Finally, reinstall the power switch. When installed properly, the T-shape on the back of the switch should be facing upside down. Close the Pi Boy up by replacing the back cover and securing it in place with the six screws removed previously. Do not over tighten the screws. Finish the process by reinstalling the battery. The red lead corresponds to the positive mark inside the battery compartment. Reinstall the battery compartment door and you're done.